Why do we need to affiliate? As you might have guessed, humans are social creatures. We have a desire to establish social contact with other people. We all have a need for affiliation. But the strength of this need varies from person to person. So we are motivated to maintain an optimum balance of social contact, the amount that's right for us. This balance is regulated by what social psychologists call the sociostat. Like a thermostat, this mechanism helps us determine when we need more or less affiliation. Even introverts and people who prefer to be alone have at least some desire to belong and affiliate with others. Social psychologists consider this need to be a basic human motive, partly responsible for driving our behavior to seek out social contact. Furthermore, the need for affiliation helps explain why we care so much about what other people think of us and why we are distressed by social rejection. People who have a close network of social ties tend to be happier, healthier, and more satisfied with life than those who are more isolated. People who are shy may have a difficult time interacting with others, which sets them up for unpleasant experiences that further motivate them to self-isolate. Interestingly, stressful situations tend to arouse the need for affiliation. Maybe you've heard the phrase, misery loves company, but this folk wisdom doesn't tell the whole story. Social psychologists clarify that fearful misery loves company. That is, we want to be around other people when we're scared. Think you hear someone creeping around in your home at night. You probably want to call the police, a neighbor, or a nearby friend. Are you alone during a tornado or hurricane or other natural disaster? Chances are, you would want to be with other people in these scary situations. In fact, across miserable situations, we tend to want to affiliate with people who are going through the same situation, who know what it's like to be in our shoes. This is one of the reasons why so many people Google questions about difficult situations. They're feeling miserable and are looking for support from others who have been in their shoes before. In other words, misery loves the company of those in the same miserable situation. Social psychologists have also discovered that feeling embarrassed has the opposite effect for many people, leading them to want to be alone. So we need to affiliate to fulfill a basic human motive and to help us cope with our emotional experiences. In the next section, we'll explore some of the variables that predict who will be attracted to whom.